No more countdown. It's time to kick off. Week one of the high school football season in Wisconsin is here with several area schools starting play this evening, and that includes Aquinas, hoping to become just the third school to win four straight WIAA state football titles. We now go live to News 19's Colton Emsweiler ahead of the Blue Golds matchup with Prairie Desheen down at Herring Stadium. Colton, what's campus like down there? You know, I couldn't watch Cali's forecast, Scott, but I can tell you it is a beautiful night for football. Maybe a little windy, if anything. And the fans are going to be out here in droves to cheer on the champs. Aquinas, led by head coach Tom Lee, who joins us now. Thank you for your time. All right, thanks for having me. And what is special about opening night compared to other games? Well, we finally get to get the fun part going. Like the other stuff, handing out equipment. Practice is a little bit of a grind, but our guys have fun at practice. But, man, this is what you do this for. Now, in case you haven't heard, you're going for your fourth straight title, but you also open up as the top team in Division Four, a higher level of competition. What does that say about your program? Uh, it's pretty cool, but it really doesn't make any difference to how we prepare. Uh, we're super process-driven. Um, we can't control any of that stuff. We work on controlling the controllables, and that's us. Now, this is a revenge game. Prairie Deshin got the better of you a year ago. What's it going to take to flip the script and beat the Blackhawks? You know what? I think most game ones are either, you know, they're more lost than they are, than they are won. So we're going to have to hang on to the football, uh, have great ball security, uh, create turnovers, and make sure we're not getting silly uh, pre-snap penalties. And they're going to try and do the same thing. All right, thank you, Coach. Best of luck tonight. All right, thanks. And while this is a marquee matchup, there's another one not too far away. As on Alaska hosts West Salem, the Panthers winning that game last year in overtime. And that's a word to get used to, Scott, because coming up at 10, it's the return of the sports overtime. And I'm so excited to break down all of the Cooley Region football tonight with you. Again, that's at 10. I can't wait to Colton. It's been too long. The Friday night lights will shine tonight. Our team all over will have highlights of those games and more. Check back later tonight at 10.